I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. Okay then. Come here, you little shit. What? No! God help! I told you it's the wedding of Vittoria Vici, an extremely wealthy <laughs> I'll be fucking relieving you of those gifts now. Never should have come here. Never should have not given me your goddamn wedding gifts. The graybeards tend not to get out much if you catch my meaning. They don't get out of the closet much. Get fucked. Yeah, thanks for the help, Lydia. Again, thanks for the help, Lydia. Couldn't have done it without you, Lydia. What? It fucking one digged me? Are you fucking serious? What is this? I don't know what's happening to it, but uh... I mean, it's certainly taking this like a champ. Oh, you want to taste my voice, do you? Boosh! Do not be afraid. Your shout will not harm us. Oh, I'm supposed to... voice you guys? Are you sure? Shout at us. Let us taste of your voice. I want to talk to my friend Sledge about that one. Dragonborn, it is you. It is me. Welcome to High Hrothgar. Thanks, mate. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? I don't know, but that guy's eyes in particular is kind of giving me the creeps. You want some? Confirm that fire is better than ice. Thanks, Lydia. For all the hell. What's up, bitches? No, no one's here. I'm just looting this guy. No cause for alarm. What the fuck? That guy knows magic? Not anymore, he doesn't. Quite like that. I know I'm I'm pretty good, aren't I? Ooh, I don't like this one bit. This is some Harry Potter shit. Read mysterious note. Dragonborn, I need to speak to you urgently. Rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood, and I'll meet you. A friend. I don't have any friends. Everything we did was for nothing. When Lord Mirak appears, all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. Time to die. Wait, what? What the fuck? What in the actual fuck is going on here? Love of my life. When you get a spare moment, I could use some water. Don't you sweet talk me, Alvar. Not after last night. I'll bring you water when I'm done with my other chores. Hello, madame. I'm the innkeeper. I'd like to rent the attic room. Attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. No attic room. What the fuck? I'll casually steal from him.
I wasn't doing so anything, I swear. Oh, it's fucking empty? What the fuck? Look, I'm not really concerned about what you have to say. I just want your loot. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. Oh, God. I hope they're right. I don't want to have this discussion with you. Can you devour a dragon's soul? Yeah, I do that all the time. Hey, dude, I got your horn. Ah, you've retrieved the horn of Jorgen Winkle. All right, then. Man, I gotta stop doing the LSD. Is that it? Oh, Jesus. You have tasted the voice of the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. Tastes like chicken. Hrothgar is open to you. No, you don't want to go up there. A dragon, it's attacking. Ah, uh, shit. I'm not waiting around to find out. Me neither. Fuck this shit. We might be too late. What? No, I oh, do I have to? I'm not ready. I haven't fulfilled my training yet. Eh, I honestly think I know what's happening up there, dude. There's a goddamn dragon, and he's probably really- Oh, there he is. Oh, God. Wait, it looks really pissed off. Can't- can't we just go back? There's a nice town up there called Windhelm. I know- I know a guy. Makes- makes some good beer. We don't need to be doing this. This is not my idea of a good Thursday. Oh, jeez, you see? A dead body is never good. I've been fucking telling you this! 